think. Yo, 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 yo. Yo, 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 yo. We're live. We are live, it's definitely. It's Sunday. It's always hard to tell because we've got a five second delay. We have. Which always makes it slightly complicated, people. So yeah, it's Sunday, it's 8pm in the UK. It's 12pm on the Pacific Coast. And on the East Coast, it's 3pm, which can only mean it's... Sneaker Stream is Sunday. It is, everybody. Live hey. Live from Pint of Stuff, if you can see it, HQ. Or Of Stuff. Of you, Stuff, As you can yeah. see just there. Of, yeah. Of stuff, but of this is pint of stuff. Um, we're, a, I suppose we are. We a sneaker channel. Well, we're we're predominantly sneakers because you haven't let me do anything else for ages. What do you mean I haven't let you do anything else for ages? <laughs> anyway, this is Mr. B and I'm Miss J. If you haven't been to uh, sneaker sneak sneaker <laughs> streaming Sunday before, yeah, we um we'll generally talk about um what we actually put out this week, um, um, which was the safari. Ooh. Yeah, now that I think about it. And I'm not sure um, I know where they are. So usually we've prepped for this by getting the shoes that we, we were gonna gonna talk about. Um oh, they're here. and we normally have them to the right hand side or the left hand side, depending on how you how you look at the camera. That's what we normally do. Um there's my hat. Oh, have you lost a hat? I wonder where that hat had gone. Oh it's in here. Are you alright? Are you right? Is it working? <laughs> Is it working? Yeah, found them. Okay. Cool. Cool. Found so, um, yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. Sorry about that, everybody. That was a slight, slight technical um, challenge, as always. But, um, yeah. So, it's Sunday. It's Sneaker Streaming Sundays. Um, yeah. If you are watching this on Catch Up and you're confused, and as confused as we are, and you like being confused... Why don't you subscribe? <laughs> yeah, yeah, why not? Yeah. And uh, we are a little bit confused because we had a late night last night. We did. It's Sunday, um, it's Sunday which yeah. means it was Saturday yesterday. It was Saturday night and we we were... You, you danced. I don't dance. He did dance. I don't. Somebody actually stood on his foot. Oh, I had a moment. <laughs> I was like... It was... So... So last night it was a black tie kind of thing, but as always, I don't usually do black tie. You don't normally do black tie. About as close as we get is a tux, but then we had like I had um like uh, tux from the top up. Top top up tux. Normal <laughs> normal service there for most people, but um, I was wearing a um, Levi's skateboarding Skin, yeah. skin tight jeans and the shadow Jordan ones. Which I thought, like, solid outfit. It was kind of fire. But um, I'd sprayed them, so I was all like, no one's going to spill any stuff on these. I kind of, apart from the weird, which I, the the spray made the, the black piece on the, yeah. the front go, um, a go a bit funny. Uh, so, oh, we've got chat as well. Hey there. Um, <laughs> uh, so, so, yeah, so anyway, we were having a, a little dance which is very rare yeah, but in these dance. parts and uh, a lady stood on Mr B's foot ah uh, she and was about he... this big and I was about to go what and then I realised that she was wearing barefoot oh yeah barefoot luckily but it was a moment of absolute <laughs> sheer terror panic I wanted to <laughs> it's like right we're leaving now um Luckily, it was all safe, and the shoes are packed away. I wiped them down this morning, but yeah, it was um, it was an intriguing evening. Yep, for uh, charity. For charity, sad tears, um, down face, hounds for heroes. Yeah, but we won't talk about that because so, it's all about sneakers. It's all about sneakers. So, so shall we have a quick peek at the safaris? Because I okay. don't think you've had them in hand. I haven't. Now, if you haven't seen the unboxing, on no, I'm on foot. It was an on foot and an unboxing on this week. And an unboxing this week yeah. of the uh, the Nike Air Safari that Mr. B picked up. What a good was it two months ago? Oh, it's gotta be now. These these are these are definitely six weeks yeah. since they dropped. Definitely. Yeah. Now you've worn them, haven't you? This I haven't. week. Oh you haven't? I thought you did. I haven't. I I spotted a colleague wearing them. Okay, and I saw somebody get off the train at Clapham in a pair a couple of weeks ago as well. And, uh, yeah, no, they look really nice on foot. I like 
the colorway a lot. I like the orange, the black, and the sort of animal -ness. Yeezy slides. What do we think? We've got, so people are watching this on catch up in the chat. Mm. We've got um, somebody asking us about Yeezy slides. Uh, oh. I, I'm going to be honest, I'm not a massive Yeezy fan. No. Um, I don't know, I just can't get on board with, with the shape and um, yeah, I'm not a fan. I did see a picture of them and I must admit it kind of passed me by. I just sort of scrolled because I was like, it's Yeezy, sorry. Um, yeah, so I uh, I have to say, as soon as I see the word, I, oh, this is so bad, isn't it? I now need to go and look them up. I, you, I mean, look them up. I mean, I, I saw them this week on either Twitter or Instagram. And, yeah. I, and as I said, I just did the, yeah. Okay, let's have a quick peek. But then I'm not a massive slide fan anyway. I'm not really one for getting my feet out. I don't like my feet. Is this the season six slides? <laughs> Is this them? Oh, mm. Mm. I, don't I mean, know. it's it, it's an if you like a slide, it's a nice slide. I'm I'm just not into slides either. Really. Let's have a look. Though. In summer, you know, I'd rather just wear a really light pair of Vans or Cons. To be honest, we're on high some variety. We're gonna have a look. There you go. Okay. See that soul reminds me of. Okay, so I don't know. As slides go, bearing in mind a slide is a slide, they're not that bad. If I look at them, I'm looking at like so. We're looking at Kanye's tweet right now. Yeah, we are. We're looking at Kanye's tweet, and he's done some interesting tweets this week. It has to be he said. Has, um. It's an interesting soul. I like the soul reminds me of something that I've seen on a pair of Nikes recently. But I'm, I'm, I'm. It's a slide in the end. I'm, I'm not feeling it. I'm, I'm gonna say as slides go, okay. As shoes and sneakers go. Mm. But then you don't really. Do you wear slides? You, I don't think no, you've got a pair of slides. I have you? No, no. No. It's, it's. Nobody wants to see my feet. I'm telling you that. No <laughs> one wants to see my feet. So we'll go back to the safari. Um, I was going to wear them this week, but then when I saw a colleague wearing them, I was like, all right, these have got to go away for at least a few months. I cannot be... And the thing is, I sit next to him. Um, we can't be seen rocking the same kicks. That is true, I guess. But yeah, I mean, it's a nice... It is a nice sneaker. It's as close to this new dad's trend that I would go, to be honest, and this sort of chunky runner shoe mm -hmm. type trend. It, just because I, I personally am not a massive fan of it. I'd rather stick with what I truly like. Yeah, and, and that's fair. And I think, you know, from a sneaker collecting point of view, I think that's probably the right approach. Exactly. There's no point in buying something that you don't like or am not going to wear, in my opinion. So, yeah, these are nice. I mean, it, it's... Interestingly, nice. it it's a sneaker that goes with far more of your wardrobe than I thought they would. Particularly like your... Um, you, you know when I'm going to wear these? When? So I'm talking at a conference, not about sneakers. <laughs> that, that would be funny. And um, I'm going to wear them at that conference. Okay. Because I think that these, these are kind of like a, a smarter sneaker. Yeah, so they remind me of the jungle pattern... Mm, yeah. Cool. yeah 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 definitely spot on there uh in the chat yeah i'm so i'm back in the chat I, room you want me to oh yeah you can do yeah, that we've, we've got chat on. going on yeah. everywhere here people <laughs> and as i say if you're watching this on catch up and if you'd like to subscribe it's um it's just down here and i was testing the notification bell thing out and sometimes it works sometimes it doesn't YouTube. But to be safer rather than sorry, I'd, I'd bash the notification bash, bell as well. Bash, bash, bash. It works best, hmm. I think, if you're already in Chrome. Okay. Um, sorry. Or, I... or you've got your mobile on, on, on you and it's going... Bloop, bloop. Sorry, the, the dog has just snuck off the sofa on, underneath my feet. I okay. didn't see him do that. 
So that that was this week. Yep. Go check out the video. Um, if you're watching this on Catch Up, I'll put the links in the in the description. Uh -huh. And uh, yeah, these nice are shoe. a really nice shoe. I'm, I'm glad you've had a proper look at them now. Yeah, no, they are nice. They are nice. A proper look at them. Um, people in the chat, last week we had some problems with audio. Mm. Does the audio sound all right? If you could let us know in the chat, that would be particularly awesome. Cheers. <laughs> I've just like thought I'd ask. Okay, there like, you go. I can't there tell without go. going and no, watching the stream. I know, I know, I know. I know, um, I know. So, do we want to show? Do, 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 do we want to give people a quick yeah, sneak so peek? Yeah, we've, so um, we've, we've already done our recording for the week. We have. And we have. Now, this is Let a get, real sneak peek. Let me we get obviously box do not want to spoil the videos. And let's pull these back so they can at least. How sneak a peek are we doing this? Uh, well, given that the woodcut paper is covering the shoe, oh. I think a look at these bad boys, people. Right, SJ. Whoa, 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 Sorry. Whoa, 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 whoa. Right, so look, SJ. Talk. Thank you. It sounds nice. Thank you. Um, so these, I'm just going to show you them like that. That's kind of a bigger sneak peek than I was <laughs> expecting. This is the White Widow 420 Nike SB drop, and um, these are super, super nice. Um, and there's some secret hidden features to them. But we'll close that up. So you've got that to come this week. Um, I really like those shoes so much. And I have... Oh, I'm so gutted I didn't get these. <laughs> these. <laughs> so first of all, before we show you, I think the, the gloss, the gloss, the gloss print here. I'm looking in the screen there. The gloss print, that should give away where these, in theory, or the collab. Mm. Um whole story in the unboxing oh yeah the whole story in the unboxing i love that these are each individually they wrapped. are individually wrapped and i'm only going to get one out but i suspect you all know what these are but you're probably expecting the canteen camo when actually i went full out crazy and went with the, la the lavender oh, so nice i might have to get the canteen like the standard anyway proper video of these come in I reckon we. If I got the if I got the other colorway, yeah, we should walk down the street together wearing them. Like, how fly would that look? No one says fly, do they? <laughs> how fly would that look? Jeez, granddad in the house. Oh yeah, that's how me. How fly would that look? <laughs> anyway, so the, these two videos are coming this week. One will be live on Tuesday. One will be live on Thursday. Keep an eye out. If you hit that notification button, you will be notified when the videos go up. Hmm. Uh, someone so so it looks like Eddie missed out on one yeah, of those. Yeah, what did you miss out on, Eddie? Was it the White Widow or, or was it the Converse? The Converse. Those Converse, I have to mm. say, I'm going to try and track down the normal camo of them. Well, I still think. Yeah. Um, and if Eddie responds, well, we can say this again. But I still think that they're available on Nike.com in the US. I just don't. Ah, but then with the exchange rate doing with the well. With the exchange rate, I paid, I think it said, um, as I was saying yesterday, yep. was it £67? Okay. So even with me importing them to the UK, I haven't been caught by customs yet. It's um, coming. It is coming, I suspect. So with the shipping, yeah. it's probably cost me about £110. And I, and I think a, they what, were a hundred pounds. Is that what the they UK? were? Is that what they were retailing at? I think so. Yeah. Okay, that's so interesting. I, I didn't, I didn't spend as much as I thought I was going to on them. Mm -hmm. However, I haven't checked back on sneakers and stuff because obviously they didn't all sell. Hmm. So could check there as well. Uh, so the Converse is sitting on the Nike app and the widow sold out so fast my purchase didn't go through. Uh, so in the UK, mm. Eddie, we what we um, we found is that they sold out in the app, but we ended up getting them from a skate store. Yes. So the the White Widow, um, we actually, well, I actually got them for Mr. B from Note in Manchester. Um, when I looked the other day, I think they still had some on Note. I don't think the Converse were in the app in the UK. Um, if you're in the US, 
they're not in the app at the moment, but they would. I bought them online on you know Nike.com. We can, do? we can do this live. Yeah, okay, you do it live. We're going to do it live. What we're going to do is, I don't think they're in the sneakers app. No, I don't think I saw them in the sneakers app at all. I, th- I think you're right there, but I think at least um, actually got me thinking now. What about the Nike app? Mm. See, I don't use that. I'm just having a quick look on Note as well. Okay. Um. So we're we're this we're, is we're, this is like the most exciting stream right now. People watching people. People watching people on their phones. Um, there you go. Bum, 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 converse. So let's have a look. Let's have a look. I don't think they're in here, but uh, that doesn't surprise me because in the UK we just do not get as much. No, the UK site is pretty bad to be honest. Yeah. It's it, it's just really annoying, frustrating. Hang on, sorry, I'm just checking. Note. If you really um, want those widows, I would, I would really look around you at your skate shops around the U.S. Um, like Black Sheep, um, Atlas. What's the best SB apparel? Um, yeah, I hear you. Two XL. I'm not sure you can get. Not in the U.K. I don't think. Yeah, it looks like they may have sold out on Note, the White Widows. But yeah, there's also, um, is it Consortium in Leeds? Mm -hmm. Is that right? Uh, It is right, sorry, I'm just, um, so, uh, it's, I tend to buy uh, the shirts. You get, you get, normally get a shirt in XL, don't you? Yeah. No, they haven't got them anymore. But currently, I'm really loving this. Um, I'm wearing right now. It's the it was the the antihero SB collab, and this top is so far my most favourite top this year. I, if if it was sunny here all the time, I'd wear this every single yeah, day. No, they haven't got them. Sorry, no white widows on note anymore, from what I can see. Did you see that? Yeah, we've. Got... <laughs> oh, I can't keep up now. I can't keep. Up. So the. The Biggie 2 pack, um, that's it actually in our news because they are pretty epic. Um, so we should probably flick yeah, to so the I news think, I think as people... we're talking about all of this. Right, let, let, let's let's <laughs> see if we can get to, not the Kanye piece. That, uh, shall we go straight to yeah, it? Yeah, let's go straight to it. Uh, bo, 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 I think it's this one. Because I one, first spotted the AF2 ah, from the Biggie 2 pack. Right. On, okay. Um, Hang on, SJ. Hang on. Right. Let's see if this is going to work. Boom. Boom, people. So I spotted these on so, Thursday, Friday yeah. on FTC San Francisco's yeah. um, Instagram. I love these so much. And I was literally like typing away to Mr. B. Have you seen these? Da, 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 da. You will want them. So um, like I like I'm loving I'm absolutely loving these denim the like the the paisley elements to, for two pack these are just so spot on I, but yeah but so when you showed me these yeah I thought initially that that they were dunks yeah but and it's, I was like it's not it's it's an AF2 yeah but then this weekend these popped up <laughs> and this is the this is the biggie dunk. Yeah. Now this is a dunk. That is a dunk. It's denim. It's frayed. It's fat tongue. It's got a fat tongue. Like, oh, <laughs> which one do you get, people? Like, which one do you go with? Which one do you go with? Yeah, they're, like, I mean, they're both super nice. Um, I guess the AF2 will be around the $100 mark. That's not a... A cheap shoe, is it? No. But yeah, east or west. Or east both. Or west. I think people in the in the spirit of peace and harmony, um, we need to get Gangs both. Gangs of love. Yes, this is all about love here. Um, these shoes are just like they are the nuts. Yeah. Um, and I think if I all right, I'm on. I'm on a different site now. I'm on, I'm on Instagram you, actually. What are you on? Uh, so nice, so nice. So that is an amazing drop by SB. I think that's going to come out. Is it the fifth of May? I'm reading May fifth. It's not in app yet. It's not in app, but 
it's not even an app in the US. No, it's not. These might appear in skate shops first. They're a quick strike. Yeah. Bearing in mind that FTC put the image up first. Mm-hmm. I think these will be in skate shops first. So hunt them down. Mm-hmm. I think that these will sell out. Yeah. Oh, for sure. These are a definite sure. sellout. Which brings us to um, like look at like look at that. That's the insole of the of, of the biggie shoe. I love it. Oh, they just look so cool. So nice. So nice. Anyway, we'll, um, let's just then, another shoe that's going to sell out that we wanted to call out. No surprises here, people. But it's the satin shattered backboard. And they're for me, not for you. Yep, they're yeah, they're for you. I, I do want these. Um, if I can get them, epic. We will see. We will see. So are these I've, actually being released in the UK? I think they are. Um, I think you can enter a draw. Ooh, here we go. It's 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 going to be another shoe that you have to, you have to enter draws for, but this shoe is is fire on every level. But I think it only goes to a men's ten and a half US. Okay. So they they because they feet no- aren't that big. Well, here's the thing. I think because Nike have realised that actually lots of people are going to want these, they've actually extended yeah, yeah, the, 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 the sizes. I get it. What I was reading as well is that they've made the black leather and the tumbled white leather on the panels the same leather that they actually used originally on the shattered backboard. Interesting. Um, which I think is super interesting. Um, yeah. No, I lo- I want to get those. I I'm really liking my oh, um, the color my pack. other Jordans. So yeah. Uh, so yeah. um, let me just check what else. So there, we talked about that. Yeah. Um, I wanted to talk about. Um, so the next. So here's the thing. Does this give you a hint as to what's coming? I think so. It's a bare brick collab, but the, I think the interesting weirdness to this was that it's an elite. Now, I'm not normally liking the elite colorway. Uh, sorry, the the elite shape. I saw the original colorway of this in Flight Club two weeks ago, had it in hand, and was like, oh. The colorway is epic. It's the sock bit I'm just not sure on. However. But I'm gutted that I didn't pick up. Now that they know that they're re-releasing these, why did I not pick these up? Oh. Um, however, mm-hmm. I think the sock bit mm-hmm. of like your cuffed car hearts mm-hmm. can kind of work. You know what this as well is? But you've got kind of chunky ankles, so you might struggle to get them off. Oh, my word. You are throwing all kinds of shade at me tonight. Like, come on, girl. Like, it's just like, what are you doing? But then I... I, I, I'm tempted. Uh, I'm tempted more because I want to see what they feel like. Like, if you think about when the elites were first, I think it's last year they were actually first announced in that in that shape or maybe even the year before no i think with, with the, the sock, sock i think it was last year and we like, and maybe. like when we first saw them we we're like no these are ugly yeah ugly like but in not not even in a good ugly shoe way no. but, but it, it depends on the colorway as you said and for some reason i think that colorway and that orange tab with the nike sb bit mm-hmm. just sort of finishes it off and doesn't make the sock bit look as ugly I, th- I think you're right. I think the other thing. Yeah. The other thing with these. Mhm. What does it look like from behind? What team do you think it? Well, I that I was gonna say it looks like it's the Knicks it's colour. It's the Knicks ways. colour. Yeah. So like, go Knicks. Um, <laughs> but I also want one of the Bears. Um, and they've got a cap coming That's out a as nice well. That's a nice cap. I'd I'd look quite like that. Uh, cap. but yeah. you, we're just not gonna get these in the UK. No. But you know we can live and try. Um, okay, so that that was the medicoms yep, that we've seen. Yeah, like those. What do you Super guys nice. think? Let us know in the chat if you're still there. Um, okay, so the next thing. Okay. Oh, it's those again. It's those again. I just thought that was there was a different picture. I've just been finding pictures of these all over the place where I was just like, I want these now. Um, so these are the Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton um, sneakers, but. I don't like these, but I just wanted to call out why these are on here. These are over a thousand dollars. These are like close to eleven hundred dollars. Like what the right? I yeah. 
It's like, why would you pay $1,100 for a pair of shoes oh, I just don't that get kind it. of look like... They look like fake 270s. <laughs> like well, they, those bit, ones do, but, like, but the black ones look like a pair of Boost. They also look like a fake, a really bad fake, fake Yeezy. Yeezy slash Boost. Yeah. I, I don't get it. You know, oh. I I really don't understand why anybody would spend the money on that. And those. that colorway that I've got on the screen right now, that looks like something that you'd buy out the back of a pickup truck somewhere. <laughs> you know, like these are just knockoffs. Down the market. Oh, just what, no. Uh, what would an elite high look like? Hmm. I don't know. I, I don't know. I think if you if we go, I think is it this one? Yep. Yeah. So I think that this technically is, is the, the elite, elite high. high. Yeah. I think that they've they've scrapped the concept of the leather the upper. The leather high and just put the sock. And, and gone with the sock. So I kind of really want to get these just so I can show people what normal people look like in them. <laughs> what normal people? Yeah, like... like Because like, when skaters wear these, like, like the guys in the magazines and in the videos on YouTube, they look super cool because they're just doing super cool stuff. Right? Yeah. I just cruise about the place. That is true. I don't look super cool. <laughs> so I want to see what they look like on foot. I'm really intrigued. Um, we'll see. We'll see. Do you want to respond in the chat to that? Yeah. Okay. Um, right. So <laughs> there was those. Yeah, we're totally with you, Eddie. <laughs> yeah. We would buy anything, to be honest, over those LVs. So I am. Um, I called these up, Ooh. and these are the Ooh. Bodega um, New Balance. Uh, they're they're a Bodega New Balance collab. They actually dropped this weekend in the Boston and, and LA stores. Okay. So I I skimmed through these, and then I just looked at what's inspired them. And for me, there's a connection. Okay. Do tell. So the colorways are actually the line, the colors of the MTA lines in Boston. Right. Okay. So it's a mass trans. So it's basically yeah. the bus, yeah, the Boston I, tube. Yes. And clearly, with my tattoo, which is all inspired by um, uh, mass transit. That is true. You know, yes, I don't yes. have Boston on here. I haven't been to Boston yet. Maybe I should add Boston. Um, so then I thought, well, they're not bad looking. I quite like that. I, I love the different colours. So I thought I'd go to the Bottega website because these were meant to be coming out um, on May 2nd online. They're not. They've sold out. They're literally sold out of these. Um, and this is a classic 998 runner. Um, I'd, I just like the colours and I like the connection that I have with the shoe, okay, I get with that. the tattoo. I get that. Um yeah, it was a bit random, I know. But I was like, oh, mass transit, shoe connection. How's this work? Uh, <laughs> uh, yes. Um, 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 I, I, uh, so, so Tonight is kind of full of... Weird shoes. Weird shoes. Right, so... So the reason I put these on, on it, right. So this is a women's vandal 2K um, double stack. And they don't go up and down. They don't like go that. up and down. If they did, that'd be amazing. <laughs> I'd be um, like Zebedee. <laughs> but like I am, um, that they, they are. What are you doing with the uh, vandal uh, people? Yeah, no. It was I, the colorway because no. obviously I've got this colorway. You have got that in the colorway, vandal, which we've which never are actually, epic. We haven't actually done an on foot for. No, we haven't. We should do. We should do that. We should do that. I just thought. You'd be amused. I wasn't going to show you this before we put it on the news, just to see. I just wanted to see SJ's reaction. But, but the thing is, take off yeah. the red sole, and that would be like an epic shoe. Yeah. So like chop it off from the from the blue bit. Mm -hmm. I'll buy that. Okay. Okay. Well, yeah. But the platform bit, no, no. I thought it was quite funny. No. Um, so no. what are we looking at here, SJ? It's so. Uh, so, so this is a tech. little bit random. So I got a, an email from Matches Fashion today. Yeah. HTS seventy four. Um, yeah, and I thought I'd scroll through, and uh, Matches Fashion and High Tech are not words that I would normally put together. So it it seems like this whole ugly dad. 80s, 90s, big chunky shoe thing is 
going nowhere. Um, and high tech are launching this premium. That's weird. Set of sneakers on a very premium fashion site, which I thought was an interesting piece of news. But it shows you how mainstream. Um, it, yeah, it shows how mainstream sneakers and the whole sports thing is has become mm-hmm. again we know it does its circles like yep. skate stuff has its circles mm-hmm. um you know i i just know these are a no from me no these are I, a no for me. i i don't care how much these shoes may be in fashion it's just a no i'm not i'm not loving them right let's um and if they're on matches, mm-hmm. I reckon these high tech are going to be in the hundred and fifty pound mark. What? So like close to two hundred dollars? Yeah, but but high tech. That's just, obscene. Just get your head around that, people. That's obscene. But anyway, that's that's the news this week, people. Those are the things that that have grabbed our eyes. Um, and um, for better, for worse. Yes, for, for <laughs> one for one reason or another. Um, so yeah, we'll come back to you. Um, so. It's really that time of the week. Yeah, so what is on your feet, Mr. B? Okay, so this week I have worn to work a number of different shoes, my usual MTEs. Mm-hmm. I've worn the... Um, Shadows. The Chicago... Okay. I wore the Chicago um, Flyknit colorway to yes, work. Yes, you did, yeah. I've worn the Shadows out to a dinner, which we all talked about earlier. But um, I also dug through the crates and um i bought da, 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 da. i bought out these now these these if i this is a dunk from 2015 black and red um i think the official colorway i looked them up earlier because i was like when did i get these Oops, sorry. um did you get these here or in the us i got them here um, so these are black, wolf grey, university red, black. Now, I didn't realise this when I bought them at the time. Apparently, these are actually inspired by Jordan 11 looks. And this is actually more of a... that They described it as the black cement colourway, which is a bit weird to see on a dunk. You'll see as well on the dunk people, just for you old school dunk people out there, that is a fat tongue. Can you see that? Super fat tongue. Super fat tongue. I've worn them all week. I've actually cleaned them up today. The thing that peeves me so much about these shoes is the leather. This leather here, while it's made to look premium, I don't know what's happened to it. It's gone really It's gone, hard. It's gone it looks really like, tough. It, it, Wait, it, it, yeah, it, I don't know whether it's because they've been sat in a box for two years and haven't really seen... Three three years haven't really seen any you know like daylight or anything but it looks like tumbled leather and you'd expect it to be as soft as some of the tumbled leather on your recent drops but it is really quite thick and hard it's not supple it doesn't feel like leather which is really weird but it is leather yeah oh yeah for sure The thing is, like, they're super comfortable. And actually, the thing I found amusing was... The, so, the same colleague who's got the safaris thought I was wearing pigeons. <laughs> I was like, no, dude. No, they're, they're not the black pigeon. Um, yeah, it's a funny it's a funny shoe. But as a colorway, I think it's, it's super clean. It's fire, really. It's like, you can't go wrong with black, red, and this kind of cement-like wolf grayness here. It's... No, they look, they've looked nice on your feet this week. Um, so yeah, that's that's what I've had on. I was, I'm, I've got them on again. Like, yeah, there's as always with old school dunks or older dunks. It's not even that old school, really. That's um, a twelve year, twelve years of dunks at that point. Yep. Always super comfy. Mm-hmm. I wish all dunks still had fat tongues again. There you just go. saying, just saying, people, there fat tongues go. for life. <laughs> <laughs> so SJ. <laughs> Yeah. Um, do you want to show us what you've got on your feet? Yeah, so I've been wearing a combination of vans this week. Yeah. And I've also had on... Mm-hmm. Hang on, hang on. Van girl for life. Van girl for life. Well, the weather's been a bit weird this week. Yeah. Um, but if you saw last week, um, you probably saw that we were crepe protecting a lot of our shoes. We were. 
And I wore these for the first time this week. And what are they? They just, are... Just in case it's not coming on the sorry. camera. These are the uh, Nike SB Deconstructed Blazer. Mm -hmm. And I bought these as soon as they dropped. And because the weather's been so bad, I haven't worn them. So this, was, this week was their debut. Mm -hmm. And I have to say... Grotty, no. Yep. We, we need to. <laughs> they need a bit of a clean up, yep. even though they've been crep protected. Um, these are super comfortable. I'd say these are one of the most comfortable Nikes mm -hmm. I've worn in a very, very long time. Really? Um, I don't know why. I think I know that you were concerned that, that because there's no pad in here, mm -hmm. that you were concerned that they would give me a blister. Like yep. your. Um, your Solons yep. did on first wear but these are actually a little bit big around the back so it's because they've got no padding because there's no padding so there was no chance of it rubbing and also mm -hmm. because there's there is no padding now i know it's an sb sole or it's an, an sb so you expect to have Can some have some movement look? in the shoe but the sole of these yeah, it's got a zoom heel unit felt it felt like I was wearing like dance shoes and that I could point my toe if I wanted to. Um, but yeah, I I love these so much. These are they're nice. A firm favorite. They're nice, and we might have to get the Crep Protect wipes on them. Yeah, because um, I had at least around the sole. Uh, realized quite how uh, how many little doing too bad. They're not but yeah, doing too bad. And I, when I was coming up the tube at yeah. Waterloo, mm -hmm. somebody caught a back of my the other one actually this and is a problem, um people yeah and i must have given that person a look must look that would kill look well if you think about it like so you clean your your favorite kicks your favorite sneakers whatever you get them ready to wear out you spray them you protect them but then you're out there in the wild with people <laughs> people stand on people people and um it's like it's just what do you do? What do you do? But then you have to wear the shoes. You have to wear the shoes. You have to wear the shoes. I'm not a non shoe um, wearer. But what what I would say is is that you need to create your rotation. Well, I have been. So this week I have worn checkerboard Vans slip mm -hmm. on. Nice. I've worn Vans Karl Lagerfeld. Nice. Uh, the tweed high, skate highs. Mm -hmm. I've worn those blazers. Yep. Um, I have worn my Air Force One. Yep. Highs in burgundy. Yep. And I have also worn mm. my yes. Come on, come on. Suspense. Maria Sharapova. Really? This Nike week? Cortez. I think. Did I wear them this week? I think they the were in before? last. I think they were in last week's rotation. I I wore my Vans California souvenir. Okay. You know so, what? Yeah, we should... I have worn pretty much a different pair every day this week. I think what what we're gonna have to do. <laughs> What 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 is um it's like actually, a van's catwalk? I think what we should do is create a a weekly rotation segment. <laughs> the, in this week's rotation, yeah, but is, I don't have as many and then sneakers do like a gallery, you. like kind of if if we could like, get we like could a do like a stop motion. We could if, if if we could get a conveyor belt just running down here. We could, <laughs> and this week we've mostly been wearing. And I have worn as yeah. well. Because it is absolutely chucked it down mm -hmm. yet again, and it's flipping freezing. Duck boots, the best hundred and twenty pounds I've ever spent on Nike.com. If you ever live in a country that rains, snows, snows, or it's just cold, you're in the fields, in the parks. You have a dog. These are the best purchases you are ever going to make. Yeah, totally. Um, I. <laughs> this is going to sound stupid. I can't wait for them to release next year's model because I'm going to get another pair. Um, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, anyway, people. Anyway. Um, so I think I think that's this week. That was a uh, thanks for everybody yep, joining us on the, the chat. Thanks for the chat and thank you to everybody that has recently subscribed. Sub subscribed. Can't talk. Um, we've hit that 500 mark. So thank you to everybody. And as I said, keep out. Keep an eye out for our videos dropping this week on Tuesday and Thursday. Yep, and of course, people will be back streaming next week. Um, hopefully, this stream was vaguely entertaining this week. And if you're watching this on Catch Up and you haven't subscribed now, by now, and also if you've made it this far. Thank you. Thank you so much. <laughs> you've basically sat through 29 minutes of two people chatting like that for 29 odd minutes. Um, 
In fact, that's 39 minutes. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. wow. Okay. Okay, um, we better go. We, we better go, people. <laughs> um, we'll see you next week. Yep. And um, until next time, everybody. Have a good week. Have a Bye. good week. See ya. Bye. <laughs>